Hey guys, welcome back to Fixing It and today we're going to fix this armrest on this 2010 Honda Pilot. As you can see over the years, this is what happens. This stuff is not actual leather, this is like some cheap vinyl. Look how thin it is. So over the years this is what happens. So today we're going to replace it with this real leather replacement cover. I got this from Amazon for like 25 bucks. And I'm going to show you how to put this on. Okay, the first thing you want to do is take this cover off. So there's four screws. Just gotta unscrew those. Okay. So now this piece pops off. So I'm gonna use a uh, just like a little trim tool I'm using. Just gotta get behind here. It just pops right off. And you're left with this, okay? Um, four screws here. We're gonna take those off. All right, simple. Okay guys, you have your cover. And now the next thing you wanna do is take this uh, handle thing off. There's two screws right here. Okay. The reason you wanna take that off is you just wanna have access to all these staples right here. If you see the staples all the way around, all around here, all everywhere. So you need to take that off, okay? Okay guys, I don't know any good way of doing this, uh, you know, besides using uh, a screwdriver and try to get under there. Uh, you know, you could try to try to pry this up like that. You know, if you could get underneath it, just pry it up. Um, I got a broken finger, so I can't really do this that well, but this seems to be working. Go all the way around and get some pliers. You know, if you can't get underneath it, I got this little pick. You could probably get underneath it like that. Try to get it up and then you know, try to try to use this the pliers to kind of pull it up. It's a panty ass job, no doubt. But So, you know, just keep working with what you have, if whatever tools you have available, you know. But this pick thing seems to be working pretty good. Get in there. All right, so now you have all these staples here. You gotta take all this stuff out. out on the staples I'll tell you that much Jeez. okay so all the staples are removed this pick thing really worked pretty good at getting underneath them prying them up and then taking them off with these uh, with the pliers so no more staples you're left with this top part which is not it's like a foamy part okay 
The next step is putting the material on. Okay, you have your material. And the first thing you're gonna wonder is which way is front or back, because it doesn't tell you anywhere. So you have your cover. And this is the front of the cover, because you took off this piece. So if you notice, the front kind of, the edge of this kind of goes down, and this kind of goes straight back. So you're gonna do the same thing with the material. The seam, you know, notice this one kind of goes down and this one kind of goes straight back. So that's the way you're gonna position it. And you wanna match the seam to the edge of your cover here. So just like that. So make sure you position this so you have enough material to overlap on both sides and in the back and the front, okay? So I test fitted the, um, the material on there. It's, there's no glue or nothing on there right now. Just to make sure, you know, this seems like you're really gonna have to stretch it to get over like that. But that's the way it's gonna look. So I got some of this uh, spray adhesive, the Gorilla stuff. I'm gonna spray some along this edge, these edges here. And then um, along along the, the edges, okay. Try to spray it on both sides. Okay, guys, make sure you shake this well before you spray it. If you're wondering what that, all the sirens are all about, it's just the fire department. I think they're delivering mums. So uh, they do the same thing with Christmas trees when the time comes. So it's kind of annoying after a while, but all right, we're gonna let that dry for about a minute and then uh, we're gonna put it together. Okay, some of this you might have to cut. This is a crazy overlap here. But just stretch it and fold, stretch it and fold. Okay. Same thing here, stretch it and fold it over. Okay. Again, some of this I might have to somehow cut.
it. What do you think? Not too bad. I wanna stretch it even more. And if you need to spray some more so some more of this stuff. Okay. Not bad. What do you think? The next thing you want to do is just, you know, with your knife, just cut some stuff, some of the uh, material here, so kind of be able to fold it. Because see this side, you know, you gotta, you have to cut it, so you're able to fold it over into these slots, okay? So, so it lays flat. And also on some of these seams, so it's like kind of lay flatter, okay? Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is put this back on there. Next thing is this cover. Okay, full of screws. Check it out guys, what do you think? This looks amazing and it feels really nice. It's like real leather, so it's not like that cheap stuff they had on there. And the color match really good. I did the armrest over there, see how that one doesn't match that well? But look at this one, awesome. For $25, can't beat it. So guys, if this helped you out, like and hit the subscribe button and I'll talk to you guys later, take care.